Hello, it's 9 p.m. in RTD. It's time to English New Edition for tonight's headlines. We have... The Ayes Arda Solar 7 wins against Afsid Dekhil. In the Ministry of Agriculture, a consultation meeting with the Jordanian delegation. For the national scene, Vietnam discovers a new variant of uh, COVID-19. Welcome to our newsroom. The team of uh, Arta 7 uh, Solar 7 wins uh, the Djibouti Cup against uh, the team of uh, Dekhil on penalty during the match which took place uh, yesterday, uh, this afternoon, at the Gulag Stadium. The President of the Republic, Ismail Omar Gil, is surrounded by, prime, by the Prime Minister, Abdul Qadir Kamil Mohammed, and the Minister of uh, Sports, Hassan Mohammed Kamil. Uh, the officials and the people of Djibouti attended the final match uh, between uh, Arta Solar 7 and uh, FC Dekhel. The two teams showed their tenacity and fair place during the matches and were separated during the penalty shutout uh, with that so which uh, saw the victory of uh, Arta Solar 7 against the team of FC Dekhel on the score of 4-3, uh, to three, a victory that consolidates its status uh, at national level and which ambition, ambition to have uh, its places at the continental level. Until the end, uh, both teams held the spectators in suspense uh, during the matches broadcast live on RTD. Neither team uh, was able to win the match during regulation times and it was during the penalty shutout uh, that uh, Arta Solar 7 won uh, the matches by beating uh, FC Dichel. After the victory of the team Arta Solar 7, the President of the Republic, which he side, the Prime Minister and the Secretary of State for Sports, Hassan Mohamed Kamil, the person in charge of the uh, Federation of the Football and the person in charge of two teams, of which uh, Mr. Tommy Tayoro, sponsor of Arta Solar 7, gave the trophies to the team of uh, which the cup for Arta Solar 7 which wins the cup of Djibouti this year so also after the victory in, uh, in 19 in 2019 uh, and 2021 the cup of Djibouti 2021 since uh, two, 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 2018 sponsored by uh, Tommy Tayoro, president and CEO of the Djiboutian team of Arta Solar 7, has consolidated its national ambition by winning the Djibouti Cup this year to 2021, recalling also that the Arta Solar 7 team was uh, crowned national champion this year. So it should be noted that the women's uh, and uh, it's uh, the Arta team and army, the Muen Djiboutian Army Forces won the June uh, 7, uh, 6 uh, cup for the six uh, consecutive years. So proud of this performance, the Harf State uh, presented them with the coveted uh, cup. Mr. Tommy Tayoro, president and CEO of the Djiboutian team of Arta Solar 7, has explained that the two teams showed their tenacity and fair play during the matches and were separated during the penalty shout, which saw the victory of Arta Solar 7. 
The Minister of uh, Agriculture, Water and Livestock, Mohamed Ahmed Awali, received this morning in his office an important delegation from the Ministry of Agriculture of Hashmi Kingdom of Jordan, headed by His Excellency Mr. Atuf Asaid Jamal Al Faid, Al Faiz, Director General of the Hashmi Fund for Development. Uh, the meeting took place in the presence of senior officials of the Ministry of Agriculture, including the Secretary General, Mr. Ibrahim Almi Mohammed, and the Director of uh, Animal Resources and Veterinary Service, Dr. Musa Sheikh, as well as the Director General of the Quarantine Center for Livestock Exports in Djibouti, Dr. Mohammed Muhyiddin Al Houdi. At the beginning of the visit, the Minister of Agriculture and Water welcomed the Jordanian delegation, which included a technical committee from the Ministry from Jordan. Jordanian Minister of Agriculture, headed by Dr. Issam Hawa, Director of Veterinary Directorate. Following a complaint of thief uh, furniture from the management of a school, the gendarmes of Sheikh Musa Brigade managed to arrest a thief uh, of another kind. Uh, indeed, uh, since the month of Ramadan, an individual wishing to make an end meet uh, had uh, the idea of uh, stealing the doors and windows uh, of the toilet and primary school located in, the, in his neighborhood. Uh, taking advantage of public uh, holidays, uh, he took 10 doors and two windows, uh, which he then uh, sold on the market at very low prices. Uh, the gendarmes of Sheikh Musa Brigada identified and arrested the, this individual uh, and after a long and uh, tedious investigation. These searches and seizure carried out led to the discovery of all the stolen furniture, 10 door and two windows in his hearing. He admitted to having stolen the furniture before selling it on the black market. Uh, he was brought to justice and imprisoned in Gabbard prison. The late Abdullahi Asoui Aden passed away at, this, at his home in Ali Sabi on the night of Monday, 25 uh, May 2021. He was born in 1940 in Gubeto. The late Abdullahi Asoui leaves behind him a large family, including 18 children and 13 grandchildren. Retired from this, from the CDA Djibouti Railway, Ethiopia, the late uh, Abdullahi Asoui Aden was also a great RPP activist who held the most prominent positions in the RPP party in the regional councils of Ali Sabih, which are the pain of the family of the late Abdullahi Asoui Aden. We offer our sincere condolence to all his family and pray that God welcome him into his eternal paradise. Inna lillahi wa inna ilahi raja'una. For the international scene uh, in uh, Vietnam uh, has announced that it has detected uh, a new variant of coronavirus mixtures of the Indian and British variants, uh, which is uh, spreading rapidly by air, a new very dangerous strain. According to the Vietnamese uh, health ministers, we have discovered a hybrid variant combining the Indian and British uh, viruses. Uh, said the Vietnamese uh, health ministers on Saturday 29 May. This new variant of COVID-19 virus detected by Vietnam is uh, rapidly transmitted through the air and is a combination of Indian and British variants. State media reported Vietnam had often held up uh, as an example for its effective anti-COVID policy is now facing a wave affected and nearly 3,007 uh, 3,700 people have been uh, infected since late April. Hanoi, the capital, is uh, concerned with uh, 357 cases, as well as Ho Chi Minh City uh, with uh, 19 positive uh, cases uh, this week. The All uh, English Champions League final played in Porto on Saturday, 29 May. So Chelsea beat Manchester City 1-0 at uh, Dragon Stadium. German Kai Havers uh, scored uh, the winning goal. So for the Blues, uh, who lifts the cup with the big ears uh, for the second time in their history. Guardiola citizens uh, uh, to timid see 
their uh, dream vanish at the stand at Porto's uh, Dragon Stadium, where a little fuel for this final, which took place in Portugal despite the COVID-19 pandemic, uh, the authorities authorized the presence of 14,000 British spectators who had been uh, screened and vaccinated a big match which fans had to add to the smartphones. It had uh, been more than a year since uh, we had seen that in the Champions League. This is it for the news. Thanks for watching us. Have a good evening.